With the DevExpress WinForms grid control, you can enable end user row resizing, or you can manually customize the height of data and group rows. The grid will automatically adjust row height when you change font settings. All these techniques affect all rows at once, but you can also customize the height of individual rows by handling a specially designed event. If your data includes lengthy text fields or images, you can enable automatic row height calculation so that the content is displayed without being truncated or zoomed out. An important part of working with grid views is using row identifiers, the grid's internal row handles, corresponding data source indexes, and visible indexes. All these identifiers serve their specific purposes and the grid provides you with methods allowing you to determine and convert those values. The grid view allows you to enable row preview sections, a common feature in email clients including Microsoft Outlook. You can manually change their height and indents or enable automatic height calculation so that the text is completely displayed without being truncated. You are free to customize these sections as you'd like, from calculating their text using your own algorithms to custom painting them to include images. The grid control can merge cells vertically, thus providing a clearer data presentation to view with lots of repeated values. You can enable the cell merging feature for the entire view or individual columns. If needed, you're free to change the algorithm that determines if two neighboring cells are to be merged. The grid view provides you with a comprehensive set of vertical scrolling modes, including the following. The default scrolling mode when the view is scrolled one row at a time. Pixel scrolling mode that provides a smooth view scrolling experience. Touch scrolling mode. Postpone scrolling and target indication via vertical scrolling tooltips. The grid control ships with the split presentation feature inspired by Microsoft Excel. It allows you to split the grid into two independently scrollable panes. You can split the grid vertically and edit the last grid row in one pane while simultaneously looking at the first grid row in another pane. The same applies to columns when the view is split horizontally. This can help end users browse and analyze data with lots of columns or rows.